Hello everyone, Dustin Williams here from Slackers in the cover, bringing you more Wizard of Legend. Last time, oh, last time, last time we had a ball. We actually made it to the third floor, defeated the first two bosses ahead, uh, with almost this setup, pretty close to the setup. Uh, I switched out the signature from the ice, uh, ice storm one, I think it's called snowstorm, to what I'm using right now, which is this nice little tornado thing has a decent range on it, that's why I'm actually intrigued by it. Because uh, you, you launch it out there, it'll travel, it'll travel, it'll travel, it'll travel, and it'll disappear. It also adds a slow to the enemy, and its enhanced version apparently will travel out and then just stop, and just stand there and attack things. Uh, the shock skill that we're using is Spark Contact, it's a basic final blow, creates a shocking electric blast, it's super fast, super strong, I mean... You can just waylay people so fast. Now, I am going to switch out. Um, I've been using the Vampire Eyes Relic for quite a while, actually. It's not an offensive. It is a defensive, which is regenerate HP every time you land a critical hit. Adds a chance to miss attacks. Now, I love it, and in theory, it's amazing, because you are going to heal a little bit over time, but I didn't realize that it has a chance to miss attacks, which makes me wonder if the amount of damage output could have been augmented. Like, you know, I, I could have had much more damage, especially with AoEs and quick hits, had I not been missing them all. Uh, I may take super, uh, super carrot kicks, since when you take damage, your max health goes up. That sounds great. I think it has a max of, like, 30 HP per floor. Now... What else do we have unlocked? We have movement speed increase, which is amazing as well. And not one I normally see on the floor, so just a flat movement increase could be great. In fact, how much of a movement increase is it? Well, that's actually... That's pretty noticeable. Now, that was defense. Offense, I believe, is I have water attack. Uh, increased water damage, yes. I have the one that uh, increases damage for every enemy defeated, but loses effectiveness when taking damage. And then this one for when you're doing... Um, tag team with a compadre. F freezing sprite randomly freezes things and this adds an extra combo in which maybe would be good. I mean, it means we're gonna attack. I don't know. Maybe this is the one actually. Throw this in there, throw that in there. I mean, we can just, just crazy damage overload. Hmm, let's try this again. What we'd be doing. Yeah, I, I, I dig it. I like it. Let's go. This one is the one I need to buy and get ASAP. Raspberry Cookie Box increases. The how often you run into uh, HP orbs, which is 25 HP, 25 HP, 25 HP. <sighs> you know, but I say this. No, no, no. no. Let, let, let's do the increase. Let's do max HP increase. Combo's great and all, but we need something that's a little bit more defensive. Something that'll hold us out overall. Let's do this, because when we take damage, our max HP goes up. That way, if we take a really bad curse or something, we can at least justify it. Alright. Here we go. I'm also wearing a brown... Cloak, which increases our armor and increases something else. It's it. Can I see it from here? I can't see it from here. It increases armor and I think increases evasion chance. It's a pretty defensive oriented cloak. A, is that just the uh, pinata in there? 
It is just a pinata. Break all this. Now we gotta kill him quickly and we get a free prize. So let's uh Wow, we actually got him real fast. It is Earthquake. Ah, you know, I don't know what the damage is on this, and I, I really like the faster attack motion of it. Jeez. Please. I didn't beat myself. That's good. I thought I did for a second. Enhanced air burst. Which is intriguing. Don't get me wrong. Aspect would be great for seeing how fast, how close we are getting to, to in melee range to begin with. That just shocks nearbys. Now, if there's an Arcana Cellar. We couldn't pick up that other Arcana and uh, Oh, blah, 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 blah. alarm. Sorry. It's my uh, prepare for a stream alarm if we're gonna do a stream. Sure about that. So another good relic to use if we can pick it up and find it is the Midas Hand, because that increases how much gold we get overall. HP, I'll take it. Oh! I lost 25 HP. That's not good. Why do I do that every single time? Get okay, lightning damage increase. Oh, Equestor Cap. Yes. Just yes. This is a hands down item to pick up every single time. Uh, it increases how fast you go from run to fast. Almost to an instant. There's no, there's no delay. Just full speed all the time. at this point should be about 340, 350. Yeah, I'm not a huge fan of that, but it is what it is. We got one to the left and north. It should actually be our boss room up here. It's not our boss room. It's our boss room. Yep. Yeah. Boss room. And 100% map completion. So, that has an enhanced version though. Oh, it's enhanced already. Do we dare take it? You know what, here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna take it for this boss battle. Because this is enhanced. 
So become a single hit Arcana with an even bigger fist. Hmm. Huge fist. Let's go. Ow. Okay. It hits hard, I'll give you that, but... I... Nah, 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 we're gonna go back and switch it out. I like my spark better, what can I say? Despite it not being enhanced. Hmm, air dash enhanced. This lightning aspect would be brilliant for what we're doing. 150, we need to take the potion, that's... That's without cause. Let's see one more movement speed, or lightning damage increase. Maybe that's what we need, more movement or lightning damage. Uh, more movement is just a flat increase. Yes, we're, we're gonna take this. That way we have, we are fast, so fast. I'm gonna see place in here, I get 83. Get uh, 17 coins, so it's gonna be, moving on to the next floor. Well, we have 562 HP because we keep taking damage and Super Carrot Cake is giving us that bonus. It's something, uh, something that gives us healing on hit. You say vampire eyes, I, I know, I know, but that mischance, that, that was just too much to... Taking less damage because we do have more armor, thanks to this this cloak. No, I thought I was launching myself into the abyss again, like that. There is enhanced version of this. Yes. Blitz, Mago Sphere. I think that takes projectiles, actually. That would be incredibly useful. 151. We'll come back for you, most definitely. So we got enough for the Magosphere. Despite me really needing to take a HP potion as well. That's a battle. It's easily a battle. Nice. 
Nice. Let's cool down, decrease there. Uh, VIP relics and other things that we can get that uh, reduce the cost of it. 243 almost makes it worthwhile. It's going to make it worthwhile for the next floor as well. Um, let us go. It was purple, right? Yes. Max Fear. Oh, Max Fear is hard to say no to. I, in fact, I'm not going to say no to it. So what this does is any projectiles that come at us get caught and go into a circle around us. I, I don't know if it's disposable or we're going to have to dodge them a second time. But any projectiles become a weapon. And the cooldown of it isn't that long considering it lasts about 5 seconds of 12 seconds. So, you know, still a decent cooldown. Alright, let's fight the boss and then we'll get the, the money from him to actually buy a potion and make sure we're ready to go into the boss. This is the Arcana's made... How you like me now? Just I can do this all day. Son, you're out. Didn't mean to warp like that, but uh, 121 HP. Yeah, let's go toss it at. No, we're gonna get this and enhance our spark contact because this gives us the sh extra shock chance damage at the end there, which is a stun essentially. Yeah, we're going into a boss battle. We're gonna get like 75 HP off the bat. That's going to kick us up to about 300. I think 300 should be enough for a first level boss. I have her abilities down pretty well. At least first level fighting time for down pretty well. I don't know about later on. We'll see. Flamer Brazil, are you ready? Are you ready for this? Let's go. Come on. Let's do it. Do you a thing. Oh, I actually need to check that. Okay, I need to I need to try that in a second when this is back up. I want to see if I can catch your projectiles. That technically those are projectiles. Yeah, yeah. So, I mean, if anything, if I use it at the right time, I at least prevent myself from taking damage from Virtile, rather than getting hit by it. What is this now? Oh, uh, that's a new... That's using her fireball. I like my rock and roll, man. I like it too much. It's way too useful. So, let's go. 21 cash, 61. We are a little bit healed up. We didn't take... Did we take any damage in that run? I, I don't remember. I, think, I don't think I actually paid attention to whether or not we took damage. Oh, 
Oh no! Oh no! Okay, a little bit of HP from now though, thank you. Okay, those don't count, despite them being projectiles. I guess area of effect is a little bit different in their books. healing too. Holy moly. Yeah, we're, we're hurt. We need to find a uh, relax shop. Get a heal on a Saperino. Oh, I, but I really want... Okay. No, we're, we're enhancing this. How you do now? Yeah, that's, that's actually pretty cool. Whoa! Not gonna help me any. Alright, right now we need to find our relic shop. No, 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 no. Of HP, thank you. That's not helpful at all. I hate to cheese this guy, but I'm gonna have to cheese this guy. Whoa! Five hanging on by the skin of our teeth. Oh, curse time. Please tell me there's a curse. Oh, glass cannon. <laughs> well, we're about to die anyway, so. Yeah, why not? What does this do? Damage is increased, but max health is reduced. It, it, it decreased my HP by 125, which really isn't that bad right now, let's be honest. No! Oh, you cheeky son of a gun. No, let's not go that way. Especially since I could have just went around, so yay for blowing 25 HP. Like that, for no real reason. Oh, man. I get a magical... HP potion somewhere. I. Yep, I don't have a good ranged attack, so that's kind of moot. Is that the only way to go down? No, it is not. Wait, can I? Can I? Oh my gosh, I can't. Well, let's just take our hits while we can. We're on the verge of dying. Wait, how did you get over there? Did I, how did I actually hit you with that? I, I, I don't know. Maybe the it, it, it went down. Oh, yeah. <laughs> when it ends, it slings off and gets him. That's great. Um... Wait for this. Means we're protected for the moment while we're in there. That's that's brilliant. So 
it doesn't break on walls now, which is it, great. Oh. Well, there's the boss room. Yay. You guys gonna come to me? No. Alright. Oh, baby. No! <laughs> Had we just... I, I, I'm, I'm just... I'm trying this again. Let's just start from the beginning again. Five gyms away from getting another... Cloak. What are you? You're that size... Yeah, that's that slam... Slam damn thing. Um... Ball lightning... Sounds amazing. I, I don't quite have enough of this. Let's try Ball Lightning. It's probably a signature strike over, over this one. Yeah, over a standard. Hold up to charge and release a devastating ball of lightning that shocks at maximum charge. Guaranteed shock at maximum charge? It's a Hudoukin. Yo, that's actually pretty bad. B BA, you know what I mean? It's nice to have a range attack. I can't move what's going though. It's the only downside to it. Let's see what Stel Star Wars Defenders is too, by the way. I keep seeing some of these things and I'm like, I don't know what this is. So, okay, here's the water prison we got. Fire off a prison of water that envelops the enemy at first strikes. It's not cool down. That's actually kind of cool. So it's like a freeze, but with water. Sour Defenders. Design my virtual of Shamrock 63 and Slamuel. This arcana allows you to form a quartet of chest knights that leap to your defense. Knights jump into place for a secondary shock after the initial leap. Do, do they actually defend? And they have a fairly quick cooldown. Oh, they're rocks. They are solid objects. Yo, that's actually amazing. Can I break them, though? Question? No, but I attack through them. Ho oh. ho. Now, do you block attacks? They do. Hmm. The gear mine's rotating. Let's go ahead and lock some more stuff since we're, we got the points. We're, we're, we're just trying to unlock more stuff to use. That new dash attack. Uh, race forward while enveloped in a watery globe that briefly shields you. And then it actually has an attack on it as well. So it briefly shields me and attacks. Okay, you're my new friend. This is a new standard attack. Uh, yeah, we haven't tried a couple of these. It's just a dragon attack. Um, summons a tunneling dragon to drive away foes. So it's a knockback of the fire version. That's the Shattering Strike, we've, we've seen this before, that's the, uh, break it, kick it thing. Cyclone Boomerang hurls a rapidly revolving air current that returns to you, creates an additional boomerang before returning to you. That's the enhanced version. That was pretty cool. Range isn't that great, though. I don't think it'd do too much in the form of, uh, knockback or... Or anything like that. So let's try standard arcana. We've got the rock, we've got this, we've got the the, the watery thingy bobber. <clears throat> Mara shield. What are we currently using as a relic? We're using the thing. Let's go all defense. Let's do defense. That's I like the idea of that. This gives us more HP. That would give us more armor. This gives us a shield that recharges after a while and reflects one one uh, attack on us. So we've got the armor increase, we've got the stalwart defenders, we've got the rock thing, we're doing our shocking damage, so we are shock and we're electric and rock type, so we're a, kind of a messed up Pokemon, that's what we are. Did 
good to see you over there. It can only project protects a one projectile. It only reflects one projectile. So it doesn't know what to do when you throw it in a small space. Check. Actually, no, I think it'd be this. Yeah, maybe it's not that blue one. I do know what it does then. Again, one of those uh, shopkeeps I have not actually done anything with yet. 31% of the map, this seems to be a bigger one. That's actually pretty nice. Sorry. So it has a little bit of a knockback. I can use that to my advantage. I need the Equestria Cap again. Always, forever, Equestria Cap. As soon as I have that, I'm bringing that all the time. It's it's way too useful. Where does it go down? Uh, on the left side. Jeez. 
Okay, so for this, that's the Blasting Sprite. That's well worth it because that's uh, just a chance to randomly stun. 258 gold. Roxas Pendulum. Give us decreased cooldowns. This will give us increased armor, which is not bad considering we're already armor focused. Oh, poison, that's what's hurting me. Boss room, almost got everything unlocked. Magnosphere, I think, would be great for us as well. Uh, we block one projectile by having a skill that gives us an additional block. When the one block's down, yeah. Was there an Arcana room? I can't remember. No, we don't have a purple arrow, so I don't think we've unlocked a purple arrow room yet. There's the Arcana room. Enhanced stalwart defenders. I feel like that would be amazing. Uh, 281, it's on sale for 100. Almost have enough for a potion. Ice Seekers. Um, don't currently have an ice skill. Yes. Just because it's a quick drop skill, I can do while I'm running around, and it does great, great amounts of damage. I can drop the light right here, and then I can just go to town. Absolutely destroy him. Wow. Wow. Insanity. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Uh, unfortunately we're 100% on this map, so there's no place to go and not enough to buy a potion, so I gotta leave on. Oh, wow, off. That, that was 1-1, one, one, and we absolutely just eradicated that guy. Ugh, oh, that makes me so hopeful for this run. The healing? Kill as well now. Arthurian is definitely the king of battles. I mean, it's just non-stop battle, 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 battle. glasses which oddly enough might actually help us at this point hmm. let's 
Let's take it. I don't have enough for it. Soon. Very soon. Where does this go? I need to go near the blue portal and to the right and then down. Breaking these because you never know what's in the trees. Oh, uh, yes. Now just straight down or to the far left. says, uh, donate, Ar donate Arcana, um, no, maybe, we'll see. The reason I took the, uh, the, uh, b b b vampire eyes is because I saw how often I was critting with the the, the, the Star Wars Defenders that he... Yeah, I mean, it, we should be getting it almost all the time. 112 HP. What's through here? Nothing we don't already have. Frostfine Fane, we don't have that one actually, but... There's still a potion for sale? There's no reason to buy one to sell for possible HP, so... Let's just take the HP bonus, bam, 100, and head to the boss. everything leveled up, ready to go. Let's go. Boss time. First level boss will be the ground boss who's still kind of a pain in the butt. Go for the guy that masters rock and stone is a little bit tough. Projectile up, ready to go. Star Wars Defenders actually can be give you a little bit of a problem. Poison. Oh, I forgot about those. So well, my friend. Farewell, a rocky journey awaits you. Yup. Oh, so you can drop different signatures. Last time I think he dropped, um, the little stone shatter thing, so. That's, uh, rebounding ice. I like it, but not for, for what we're currently doing. Fire next, interesting. You haven't fought her in a, a second level pattern before. Oh, oh, oh. Don't you guys mess me up already, come on. You guys are having a good job at messing me up already. Good job.
Gotcha. HP, I like it, I approve. That there's still something alive. Okay, so one, two, dash. Oh, that's not good at all. How about a uh, full heal? Can I get a full heal, please? What are you? You're the tra trap dash, which throws poison, poison stuff down every so often. Uh, throw an extra toxic bomb forward. Uh, I, I dig it. Don't get me wrong. But I think we need to die with what we came in here with. Might be a little more sticky. Oh, when I say a little bit sneaky, I mean very sneaky. He th we threw a dynamite at us. Okay, two healing orbs uh, didn't actually heal much, to be frank. Ice thingies. What does the enhanced ice seekers do? Additional seeker. Okay, I can see that. And for those of us about to die, we salute you. Do I want another seeker? Let's see. I'm on a relic shop. Which this is not the case of the relic shop. That's a battle. Oh, that's a battle we're gonna have. Oh no! HP. What? What? Horrible. This isn't a battle. I've already. It's a place I've already been, actually. Well, goes without saying. Don't know what this does, and still can't afford it, so still don't know what it does. If we get the money to do that, we'll pick up that one, because uh, I really want to know what that. That uh, stopwatch does. The more we learn, the more we know. It's kind of a dumb saying if you say it like that, but it, it's true. You know, we're, we're trying to learn more about the different items and stuff available to us, and so we know for sure what things do. We, we just kind of are in the dark. No! That skill went off after it died. That's not fair. Oh, that was easy peasy. What did we get? We got a new R skill. Wind Flurry. Uh, and unleash, a, unleash a quick salvo of cutting winds. Projectiles pierce enemies, but attack range is lowered. 
Alright. I can dig it. Just got a little bit of money out of that, too. So, relic shop. Let's get this timepiece. What do you do? Designed by Artesian Kurt Tozy to Tokodolowski. This relic reduces cooldowns while also reduces signature charge rate. What cooldowns are we looking at? Yeah, that's five seconds. Okay. I dig it. Time for a boss battle. Guys! Oh, he got me. That that one skill was not a good one to use in our situation. Not with the, us trying to stay running around. Oh, does it actually take screenshots of our, our, our travels until we died and what happened? Stalwart Defenders Enhanced. Probably the best choice we made, Stalwart Defenders. Well, shoot. We don't have enough for a new signature. But... What do we got here? Cardus Prime? What is this? this is a new, no, that's a new dash attack. Skills of Babylon. The circle line. Let's see what we're getting here. New dash attack. Lightning dash. Jolts ahead, leaving behind electric orbs that are chained together after a short delay. Ooh. And then, love of the Star Wars Defenders. Let's see what else we got. We got Skills of Babylon, designed by Virtuoso Sean Aramaki Redinger. This Arcana allows you to lower active cooldowns and steal speed from enemies by blasting them with a burst of air. Ooh, so steal speed from enemies. Okay, so dash attack. I can have. Actually, that does pretty good damage. Oh, you can steal speed from enemies, that's, uh, that's pretty cool. Cooldown reduction work for your basic. Hmm. Okay. Uh, air spinner. It's a basic. What we got here? Throw a disc of air that orbits around you. Interesting. I could try this out one day. Go down for me. It does speed up a little bit of everything. I like it. Um, and then we have 15, so we have enough for one more. Do you want to get... I haven't seen Flag Gauntlet. I haven't picked it up, excuse me. So let's see what this actually does. Just out of curiosity. Defense, it looks like. What's the defense? Was it miscellaneous? It is. Allows you to destroy enemy projectiles with melee. Allows you to destroy enemy projectiles with melee basic arcana. Do you realize what this means? This means if we were to take flak and have like this going, we could technically protect ourselves. With our melee basic attack, that means... Oh my gosh, that, that's actually amazingly useful. If we had an attack like this that goes all around us with a basic... Shoot, that's what I'm doing next time. Next time I'll be trying that. I'm gonna see how well that works. What else did I buy? Um, oh yeah, Cardus Prime. Um, what does it say? Conjure a rapidly revolving ring of icy blades. Conjures additional blades and all blades fly outward and released. As the evolved enhanced version. Yeah, I, I, yes, 
I like that. It's amazing. In fact, that makes me want to use the chakrams as well. And then we can have uh, like a pop this, pop this, pop this, and we got just the blender. In fact, I'm going to do this blender build next time, but thank everyone for joining me. Thanks for hanging out. For more news and information on what's going on or what may be, check out the description below. If you like what you saw and want to see more like it, slap the like button, bash the subscribe button, and share the video. Visibility on a small channel is our greatest foe, so sharing is garing. This is Dustman Avenger from Slacker signing off. Later underground.